Hello everyone, welcome back to another tutorial on Tableau. Today we are going to make a dashboard on our profit analysis on Tableau. So now I'm using sample retailer dataset to make this dashboard. Now we are creating three charts. First one is the line chart to show the profit over time. The second one is going to be the map chart to show the profit in all the states. And the last one will be a bar chart to show the top 10 profitable products. Now let's create our first chart, which is a line chart for profit over time. Rename the sheet as profit over time. Now drop the profit to the rows here and drop the order date to the columns and select it as continuous month. Now we need to do a little bit of formatting. So go to the format and select workbook. Let's make it bold and change the color to black. Now we need to change the color of the worksheet as well. To do that, right click on the view and select the format. Go to the shading option and change the color. And also we need to remove the grid lines. So go to the format line section, go to the rows and select none in the grid lines. Now we need to show the trend line here. So to do that, go to the analytics tab and drop the trend line and select linear. The last thing we need to do is to show the region filter. So right click on the region and select show filter. Now our first chart is completed. Let's move to the second one, which is profit by state. So just duplicate this sheet and rename it to the profit by state. Uh, keep the formatting as it is and remove all the rows and columns and filters here. Now let's drop the state to the view here. Drop the profit to the colors and just change the default properties and show this profit to the label as well. Now let's create our final chart where we need to create a chart for the top 10 profitable products. Again, duplicate the sheet and rename it to top 10 profitable products. Now just drop the product name to the rows and then drop the profit to the columns. And now we only need the top 10 products. So we need to filter it out. Drop the product name to the filters and go to the top section. Select by field and enter 10 and click OK. Now just change the view to fit height. Now we need to remove column grids. So right click on view and select format. Go to the format lines option and then go to the columns option. And select grid lines to none. So now we've created our three charts for our dashboard. Now let's create the dashboard. To do that, go to the dashboard option, select new dashboard. Here you can see all the sheets on the left side, which we will use to create our dashboard. Now drop our first chart, which is profit by state to the view here. Now we need to drop the other two chart as well. So drop the profit of a time chart here and we also want to show the 10 profitable products. So drop the third chart as well to the view. And you can change the format of your dashboard according to your need. Now that we have all the charts added into our dashboard, let's first change the color of the dashboard. Go to the format option and select dashboard and in the dashboard shading, Pick the color of your choice. So now we will add the filter as well as we have already have the region filter here. Also we need the filter for years as well. I've already added the filter to our sheet. So go to the more option here and go to the filters and select year of order date. Now we have two filters. First one is region and the second one is years of date. Now let's change the map formatting. So to do that, go to the profit by state sheet and then go to the map option, select 
background map of your choice. Now the filter that we use in our dashboard right now are just working on profit over time sheet only. But we can actually use that filter to the other related data source as well, which means that if other charts are created from the same data source like we did, then you can use this filter to the other views as well. So to do that, click on this drop down, select the option apply to worksheet and then select the second option which is all using this data source. Do the same for the second filter as well which is the order date filter. And now both of the filters are working on all the edit views. Now it's all done. Just click on the slideshow to check your dashboard. It has three views, profit by state, profit over time and top 10 profitable products. And also we use two filters to filter out the specific data that we want. That is it for this video on how to create dashboard in Tableau. I hope you like this tutorial. Thanks for watching.